Mitch, this group has been so resilient. Uh, bounce back seems to be in your DNA. Um, how do you prepare to bounce back yet again? Well, I think we can uh, confidently say that wasn't our best showing the other day. And so uh, when, you, when you don't play up to your expectations, I think it's easier to kind of flush that one and, and move on to the next game. We did have a heartbreaker against Houston, um, and we had a game in our, in our clutches and we lost it. And that one, that one kind of hurt. So you had to bounce back in a different way. But this one, I think we know, you know, there's a lot more we left on the table and, and we can go get that. The past experience of doing it before, how much does that fuel your desire and your ability to know it will happen again? Well, we have a great group. We do. We have uh, talented players, uh, great people around us, and you know we have that expectation to win. And I think that's something that everybody understands. And and you know we're going to show up tomorrow ready to play. The emotional fire that you have seen from one of those great members of this group, Corey Seager, um, what has that meant to you? D did you expect that? I did expect it. I've seen it before. Um, you know, I saw him do it in Dodgers. Obviously, I was watching on TV at the time. Uh, but I saw him do it before, and, and you know, we hit that homer in, in game seven to lead off, and uh, we felt that fire from it, and I think that really got the boys going. And obviously, one of the bigger home runs that I've ever seen in person, maybe one of the bigger home runs in his career against Seawald in the ninth the other night, uh, that was awesome. And just to see him react the way he did, and, you know, he's a big reason we're here today. And you made an interesting point when we were talking earlier that you maybe didn't see that during the regular season. You knew it could exist, but now you're actually seeing it being realized, all that emotion. Yeah, he, uh, he's got a thing for the big moment. And, uh, you know, Corey's a great player, and uh, he, is, he, he wants to perform on the biggest stage. And that's why he's, he's that face of the franchise for us, and uh, he is uh, our leader, and, and we're going to follow right after him. Finally, this is an overly simplistic question intentionally. How much fun are you having? <laughs> having a lot of fun. A lot of fun. Um, yeah, very simple question. Man, we're the last two teams playing baseball, and we're playing for a World Series, a World Series that I've only ever seen on TV. Um, and, you know, to be one of the last two teams and, and have a chance to put your mark on history is really special.